Investigation is another problem plaguing the president. It is a complicated story, so it's no surprise we've been getting emails like this one. Please explain to us exactly what the Russians did to influence the election. We never hear exactly what they're accused of. Well, tonight, political analyst John Keller tries to sort it out. Russia, if you're listening, I hope you're able to find the 30,000 emails that are missing. That was last summer. Probably... Since then, President Trump has accepted the finding of multiple U.S. intelligence agencies that Russian President Vladimir Putin ordered an influence campaign aimed at electing Trump, which included stealing emails from top Democratic officials and giving them to the group WikiLeaks for release to the public. There is no evidence of Russian tampering with votes or that their meddling made the difference on Election Day. But a string of events Nobody has raised questions me. about possible Trump campaign collusion with the Russians that are at the heart of multiple ongoing investigations. For instance, former Trump campaign chairman Paul Manafort quit the campaign amid reports of his work for a pro-Kremlin Ukrainian leader. National Security Advisor Michael Flynn resigned after being caught lying about his contacts with the Russian ambassador to the U.S. And Attorney General Jeff Sessions had to recuse himself from the Russian probe because he failed to disclose similar contacts. And even with evidence of his Russian business dealings, like the ill-fated Trump vodka line sitting there on YouTube, and his own son's admission in a 2008 interview that Russian money makes up, quote, a lot of our assets, Mr. Trump remains defiant. To get involved with Putin, for I have nothing to do with Putin. I've never spoken to him. I don't know anything about him. Now, the inability of the president and its allies to get their story straight on all this has fueled all sorts of speculation, but that's all it is for now, speculation, as are unproven allegations of leaking and surveillance on the part of Obama administration officials. For now, the only known fact is that the Russians tried to mess with our politics. And on that score, you'd have to say, mission accomplished. Paula, Liam. Right. And more investigations to come. John Keller, thank you. Well, it is sticky and